the greater fork beer. Ficus blenoides, the greater fork beard. It's a funky fish with facial features that can make ZZ Top feel jealous. In Cornwall, they call it plus fours, but well, I've never seen one in trousers. In Ireland, they know it as sweaty betty, though exactly how you tell if a fish surrounded by water is sweating, I do not know. Maybe, maybe all that salt water isn't the sea after all, it's just that a few fork beard came back from the gym or a particularly strenuous Zumba session. We could all walk to America if only bought some roll on. But Betty might be in some bother. Very little research has been conducted into the stock levels of the Greater Fork Beard, and the Marine Conservation Society is giving it its worst rating of five, meaning that this is a fish to avoid eating. Don't stick your fork into a fork beard. We've been here before. The fork beard is a member of the cod family. Because of our fishing techniques, Atlantic cod numbers are much smaller today than they were 30 years ago. And so too are their bodies. Because we harvested the largest fish, the cod has evolved to grow faster and stay small. Because of our dietary habits, many fish have now evolved to not have fingers. Deep sea fish are particularly vulnerable to overexploitation. They are slow to mature and so their populations take a long time to recover. Fishing quotas are currently set above levels recommended by science, so if we want to save these species we have to act now. Let's listen to the researchers. Science. It works. Fishes. The deep seas and the fish that live within them need our protection. Please like and share this video if you want your minister to take action.